Hey y'all, what's up? Um, so as y'all know, I am leaving to flight attendant training. Use the right lane to take a slight right. Yeah, turn right. I am turning right. I am. Um, so hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I am taking you guys thrift shopping with me because I leave to flight attendant training in a few days. And right now I only have like three outfits. And we all know training, it, well, we all don't know Chuby, but training is three week long. For those of you that are just tuning into my flight attendant journey, I will be leaving to flight attendant training in a few days. In a few days. Um, so I need flight attendant training clothes. Flight attendant training, pretty much, I'm gonna be flown out to another state and I'm gonna be staying in a hotel. Therefore, I don't know the washer dryer situation at the hotel, and I also don't know if I'm gonna be able to have a ride to a laundromat in case um, they don't have a washer and dryer on site. So being, so for that reason, I wanna be, I wanna go to training with enough clothes. Um, so yeah, today we're going thrift shopping for some flight attendant out for some flight attendant training outfits because I just need things to get me through training because during training I will be getting fit for my uniform so I just need some outfits to hold through so we're gonna look for some skirts and white button-ups and then when I don't get find a skirt with a white button-up then we're gonna look for some navy dresses hopefully with some sleeves because if we don't wear sleeves then we have to wear like cover up and stuff and then it'd be too hot for all of that so Oh, I wanted to take you guys on my journey so you guys can see how frustrated I get because y'all know I got this new booty and nothing freaking fits me. So we're at the first thrift store now. Wish us a luck. They don't really have a lot of like dress options. It looks like a lot of shirts. They have some black dresses. Alright, so I'm leaving the first thrift store. Didn't see anything there. Um, I don't know if it was like the prices that turned me off that I showed you guys. Or, I don't know. I couldn't really find anything. And the energy wasn't there. So, I'm going to thrift store number two. Um, I feel like I need food. Because that's probably why I'm in a bad mood. And when I'm in a bad mood, I am not going to like try to find anything. And I also don't like going to thrift stores that are, don't have any deals going on. Like, I feel some way. Like, you guys get this stuff for free and then you guys want to take advantage. Woo! You want to take advantage of the shoppers and overtax for the stuff. Like, seven, $7 for a dress? I might as well just go to a real store. So, let's go, guys. Give me some good I need some good deals. So I just got to this one. They're having a sale. I like coming to um, this one because it's huge. I've never been to this location though. Um, but I came to their other location the other day and got a lot of stuff. So I'm a hope that at this location I'll find some good stuff too because your girl needs some jewelry some heels they got a lot of stuff here so I found these shoes so far what y'all think but the heels that I found, I think they're brand new, but they say originally, I guess they're $6, but these say Redline shoes are 50% off. So I guess that would make these $3, but we're gonna see once we check out. So we're gonna keep those. Um, 
I keep getting distracted because I see so much other cool stuff. Like I really love this um, clutch, but I don't know how much it costs. I really like this. I don't see a price around here though. So we have the option to wear pearls or a scarf. So I'm gonna get a bunch of pearls. Also found this one. I'm gonna have to like mute this part of the video because um, they have music playing in the background. And I need to get monetized. <laughs> This is like their jewelry section. It's a lot of stuff, but this is the prices for everything. They have a lot of options, but I don't want to go too crazy over here because necklaces are $5. Yeah, I feel like my clothes that I find are going to be cheaper than that. Oh, they got a lot of nice watches. This is the first dress. So this is what it looks like. I like this color. I couldn't get the back zipped all the way. But this one is eight dollars. <laughs> this is an, this is the other dress. Um I couldn't really get it up, the booty part. It's like stuck back there. But I don't think, I thought this one was more of navy blue, but I guess not. And the material makes it really hot. So I don't think I'm gonna get this one. What y'all think? And what is up with this? Hey, 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 hey. So I was gonna show you guys this one but I think I put the skirt on backwards. So let me fix it. Yeah, never mind. Um, I just feel like it looks like um kind of like military-ish. I don't know. I don't really feel like classy, sexy with this. I feel like it gives me like military vibes um I don't know I feel like it's smushing my hip but you know what let me just try it It's not going to go up. So out of the ones that I tried on, I think the first dress was the only one that fit me. Let me get the first dress and leave this thrift store. Oh, you know, just freaking sitting in the car this whole time talking to a phone that wasn't being, that wasn't recording. Um, that does, that, that pretty much sums up my experience in the store. So I'm finally leaving. I returned all the necklaces except for one because 
They were five dollars a piece. Ain't nobody got time to be spending five dollars. Five dollars a piece. I got the one that I really liked. I should just, I'm gonna do like another vlog, maybe trying on everything that I ended up getting. But I did get one necklace. I did get one necklace. And I got this clutch for six dollars. Everything here was just like on the pricier side, and everything that I liked was not on sale. So I spent $32 at this thrift store, which is not allowed. Um, I try to always keep it under 20 at each store I go to. Under 13 is really good. Um, but yeah, on, I only got one dress. One dress for flight attendant training. So I definitely ended up buying more stuff here that's not for flight attendant training. I got one dress and I got heels. So hopefully now I have time to go to another location to keep looking for more dresses. So I'm going to the Salvation Army. That's going to be the second thrift store, which I'm kind of breaking my own rules because I tend to like not go into Goodwills and Salvation Armies. I just feel like they're always overpriced. They don't have good deals. But I'm passing one right now, so I figured I might as well go in here and see what they got, if they have any options. So we about to see. We about to see. So this one's kind of big, pretty good size one. We're gonna see if we find anything worth finding there. All right, so it's starting to rain. I'm, leave, I'm leaving um, the Salvation Army. Didn't get anything. I don't know why I came here too. I like wasted my time coming here because I don't like going to the Salvation Army or the Goodwill. I just boycott those two thrift stores. I feel like they're not thrift stores. I don't consider them thrift stores, so, um, yeah, I don't know why I came here and wasted my time, so I didn't get nothing here, and it kind of looks like I'm in the hood, which nothing wrong with the hood, the goal is to get up out the hood, but I feel like when you're in a low, impoverished area in a thrift store, you're not going to get the nicer stuff because... You need to go to the thrift stores where the rich people are donating their stuff. Because they're the ones that got the nice, sophisticated, classy, and new items that they donate. So in here, the store just stunk. Um, everything just looked crappy. Um, I was looking for some white button-ups, but I'm not going to pay like $4 for a white button-up that's been used with, mark with stains on it when I could get it like brand at a brand new brand new at a different thrift store or just buy a brand new at a real store at the mall so yeah i wasn't really vibing with salvation army and i don't ever vibe with goodwill so i don't know why i came here so let's go find something else to go let's find somewhere else to go to okay are you trying to be my little boo can you come over and cook for you? No. Are you trying to be my little boo? Can I come over and cook for you? I don't want to make no rice and chicken. But I know how to make some tender loving. Can I come over and do Use the whatever to you want to do? Merge onto State Road 202. Whatever you wanna do. It's the remix. This is how you know you live in Florida. It was just raining at the Salvation Army. And look now, 10 minutes later on the road, it is sunny. You see how sunny it is? It is sunny, honey. Can you come and put it in my tummy? Oh, okay, let me just chill out. <laughs> All right, just got to a third thrift store. This one is massive. They have a lot of options. 90% off white tags. So hopefully some of the stuff I need is in a white tag today. What y'all think about this skirt? So I really like these, but I think they're too big because when I walk this one, 
my shoe, like my foot comes out of it. But they're so freaking comfortable. Yeah, the right foot, I feel like the right shoe is way bigger. Do you want anything to drink from the gas station? Um, let me turn the car on. Okay, so this was my third thrift store. At this point, I'm over it. I've only been successful in finding the one dress. Um, so yeah, maybe we'll try this again tomorrow. Because your girl is dehydrated. I can't believe they don't have nothing to drink at the freaking thrift store. Like, sell some water or something. I'm just over it. It's too hot. The heat is getting to me. And... On top of that, the thrift, thrift store I just went to is a church thrift store. So everybody already looking at me like I'm a little thotty because I got this. I put this like dress on. I put this dress on so that it's easy for me to like try things on. But the thickness is out and the old people looking at me like, girl, put some clothes on. So I'm going to go get something to drink. And then call it a day. If I change my mind, I'll let y'all know. But for now, I'm calling it a day. Thank you guys for keeping me company. I love y'all. And yeah. Um, toodles. <laughs> what I need. This is what I need. I've been right here. They probably don't got no soda water. Oh, why don't places have soda water?